Here's the story of a foster family who is living with 10 boys they rescued from tough homes. They're giving, they're loving, but they really need some time to just let go. call Ed and Amy Bartles the ideal couple. Only they've chosen to take on a very challenging and complicated family life. We're really not your typical family. We're a little unusual to say the least. Yeah, we're kind of like the Brady Bunch, but I kind of like to think that we're more like the Adams family. <laughs> I'd agree with that. Well, they started out pretty normal. High school sweethearts, marriage, kids, and then tragedy. We had a little girl um, 23 years ago who passed away at All Children's. When we were there, there was a story on the news about a baby found in a dumpster, and I held my little girl while she died. And there was this baby in this dumpster, and I will never, ever forget that. At the time, I was angry. I didn't know it was really what, what God wanted me to do, was to in time open up our home and our family to these other children that, that need some stability and just a place to stay and be safe. So um, when our kids were young, we decided to be foster parents. Through Eckerd, a nonprofit Florida foster care service, the Bartles have taken in more than 70 children over the past 10 years. All of our kids in foster care just want to feel normal, want to feel loved, and the Bartles are just doing that in so many ways. First night we were foster parents, we brought four little children into our home, and I have goosebumps now. My life was forever changed. I would say from A to Z. I mean, they've, they've experienced sexual abuse, physical abuse, mental abuse. We have a little four-month-old boy come into our house, um, just a beautiful child, and he had a compound skull fracture. Um, he came to us from all children's. He had been thrown against a wall. And I keep thinking, in this date and time, we're, it's going to stop. People are going to wake up and realize what a gift their children are. And that's what we always, I think, Ed, try to focus on, right. is finding the forever home and the permanency because when they come, they are so broken and they don't trust anybody. And why would they when you can't trust your own family? Why are they gonna trust a stranger? And we just start to love them and be consistent and set those boundaries. And in time, you watch them open up. It's a miracle is what I would call it. I would say every day is a new adventure. Speaking of adventure, you can imagine just how much the Bartles could use a break. Coming up, the family who gives finally receives a major league gift of a lifetime. Childhood should be filled with wonder and joy, but for too many, it's filled with suffering and pain. Countless children are abandoned, suffer abuse and neglect, feel depressed and alone, and don't know where to turn. At Eckerd, we know every child should feel safe and loved. Each one deserves a second chance at happiness and success. Join us in making a difference. Eckerd, the first name in second chances. Now, at Tradewinds Island Resorts, the coolest, most exhilarating water sports ride of your life. Jetland. It's unlike any thrill ride you'll ever experience. You can fly. Take your beach vacation to new heights at Tradewinds Island Resorts on St. Pete Beach. The only place to fly Jet Lab on Florida's West Coast. Are you ready to fly? I'm Guy Harvey, and I'm really proud to support this season's Real Dream Makers TV series. The most powerful way to teach and interest children about marine conservation is to put them on the water with a rod and reel in their hands. A key goal of the Guy Harvey Ocean Foundation is to educate and inspire our future generations about the wonders of our oceans. That's why we support programs like Real Dream Makers and the families that gather to watch them. We hope you enjoy watching Real Dream Makers as much as we enjoy helping to bring it to you. Amy and Ed Bartles are foster parents. Hi, welcome to the Trey Ones. Who've dedicated their lives to rescuing special needs children. They currently have a dozen kids, including two of their own. Is that it? 
You know, Real Dream Makers is going to give this family the time of their life, and I cannot wait to see the smile on their faces. First, we whisk them off for a dream vacation at Tradewinds Island Resorts on St. Pete Beach. You ready to go have some fun? Yeah! All right, let's do that. Come on! Wow. I was like, no way. This is like... I'm not staying here. This is just a joke or something because Ed likes to joke around. So I was like, I was like, holy crap, this is huge. And when we told them we were coming, they were just screaming and bouncing and jumping. And it, it was just, they were so excited. <laughs> Tell you one thing don't eat, don't eat before you go on this thing. Don't. So you like to swim, huh? When I walked in, I was like, wow, I really like have VIP access to anything and I was looking around and stuff and I was just like, I really didn't think I deserved it really. What I first thought was, man, I think I'm probably gonna have a wonderful time. It, this is because I never had a vacation ever in my life. First vacation ever. It's like having your own Disney World in your backyard. Free snow cone, baby. I won the belly flop contest. This place just gets better and better. I got more stuff to do. Peace. Well, greetings, everybody. Let me introduce myself. The pleasure's all mine. My name is Captain Redbeard. Anything they've been through or haven't been through, it, like it's not on their mind. And that's just, I think, the best gift of all. What was his problem? Very good, mates. Thank you very much. <laughs> I think the kids needed it. Some of these guys have never experienced a vacation. And, and one like this, I mean, just amazing. <laughs> Bungee jumping and, and water slides and pools and paddle boats and. The, the water park out in the golf. I mean, they've never done anything like that. You bet Amy and Ed needed this too. <sighs> just free. <laughs> yeah, I just, free. when we were out there, very relaxed, just the kind of yes. ocean was just kind of, yeah. just kind of letting everything take away. And, yeah, it's kind of like and, we were just a thousand miles away yeah. on a desert island and we were just floating out there and the birds were flying and the sun was so warm and felt so good. We had a drink and we're gonna do that again, honey. <laughs> <laughs> and as this day winds down, the Bartles settle in for a sunset dinner like no other. They've not been to a really fancy restaurant. They, Why do I have two forks? <laughs> you know, things like that. And it's a wonderful teaching moment for them. Oh, okay. you don't like Thank olives? You. I'm surprised. You know, in any day, I would say we're so much a normal family. We laugh and we cry and we yell and sometimes they're grounded. And, and it's, you know, I, I could sit here and tell you that everything's perfect and everything's fun every day, but you know, it's life. It's a real life. I have great faith. I go to bed every night and we know we've done the best we can do. The best is yet to come. Did we mention the Bartles love fishing and baseball? Put those together and you've got a field of dreams ahead. That's pretty cool. Tradewinds Island Resorts, St. Pete Beach. Reserve your sunset now and save with great fall rates. Just let go. Get hooked on Real Dream Makers. Go fishing with your favorite celebrities on board with Captain Mike Anderson. That one. Nice. This isn't just a fishing show. We make dreams come true for deserving families. Each episode packed full of extreme beach vacations. Oh my gosh. Adventures, surprises, celebrity fish tales. That's what it's all about. Don't miss Real Dream Makers Sunday and Tuesday mornings only on Fox Sun Sports.
College Hoops fans, see the Gators chop down on the Blue Raiders as NCAA Men's Basketball returns to the Tampa Bay Times Forum. Sunday, November 18th at 4 p.m., Billy Donovan's Florida Gators take on the defending Sunbelt Conference champion Middle Tennessee Blue Raiders. And you can see all the exciting action for as little as $15 a seat. Get your tickets now at 800-745-3000 or at Ticketmaster.com. Don't miss the slam dunk excitement of Florida Gator basketball. For this special edition of Real Dream Makers, our team is navigating the backwaters of Boca Grande, just a line drive away from Tampa Bay Rays training camp, and a chance for Captain Mike Anderson to treat star baseball pitcher James Shields to an afternoon he'll never forget. Uh, it's definitely nice to, to get a little uh, half day going and come out here and go fishing, um, especially with the kids. So you've been catching fish here, what do you think? Yeah, we're going to uh, creep up on here and uh, there's a bunch of mullet working their shoreline and generally this time of year all your redfish and snook are, are still swimming with all these mullet. And fishing alongside this major leaguer, four members of the Bartles family. You know, what an amazing family. I mean, this family hosts a, a, a bunch of foster kids. Um, you know, they, had, they fostered a couple kids themselves. We got them out here right now, David and Matthew over here. and. Uh, and you know it's very it's just nice nice to come out here and enjoy enjoy a nice day of fishing hopefully we can catch a bunch of fish and uh, you know have some fun to be able to go out on a, a charter boat with with uh, captain mike and and james is just it's just phenomenal under a cloudless charlotte harbor sky captain mike anderson gives the helm of the boat to local captain and guide justin kaufman it's always best if you don't fish an area all the time to uh, count on some local knowledge and Justin's one of the truly great young captains that we have here in Florida and uh, so Justin's got us out fishing. We got the little guys out and uh, we're gonna try and put everybody on some fish. Both captains eager to show Ed Bartles and three of his 12 children, most of them foster kids, a day filled with big league catches. <laughs> And yes, we're talking Big Game James, star pitcher for the Tampa Bay Rays. I'll tell you what, this is a little more relaxing than facing the Yankees. Never caught a redfish. Never caught a snook either, man. I've been in Florida way too long not to be out here. Oh, we got one! Easy. Nice. Easy, easy. That's it, that's good, that's good. This is my first fish today. Nice. I just spotted sea trout. Um, they're all over here in Charlotte Harbor. Well, at least we're off the schneid here. Good job. Nice job. From the minute James got out of the truck at the marina, he was absolutely just great. He was just one of the guys, you know, easy to talk to. He was just absolutely fantastic with the kids. Dad! Come he caught a red fish! Nice. Yeah, it looked really good. There you go, James Shields. They normally have four spots like that? No, no. Sometimes they just have one on each side. Sometimes you'll get catch one and it'll have spots all over it. Just depends. Sometimes in some areas of the state they have spot tournaments right. where it's not the size of the fish but how many spots it has. Right. Oh, no kidding. That's awesome. I plan on catching more. <laughs> there we go. Free to be. Hello, boy. Good job, James. It's good size right there. Sea trout. It's a snook. I think he jumped out of the water. Nice. Nice. Pitching baseballs in the morning, catching snook in the afternoon, <laughs> baby. Three, diff three different fish, baby. Yeah, there's your slam right there. Well, there's three. It's a Florida inshore grand slam for James. A trout, a redfish, and a snook. Yeah, I don't like giving up grand slams, man. But I don't mind catching some grand slams. <laughs> 
everyone else was focused on fishing, the youngest member of this party spent much of the day enjoying dessert. Oh, that's a good redfish right there. Pull and, pull and go, pull and go. Pull up, pull up. There you go. Reel in, reel in, reel in, reel in, reel in. Go back, go back. <laughs> Long photo op. <laughs> I love redfish, tough as nails, tough as nails. Don't reel no more. Don't reel no more. Just hold it right there, you got it? You got it? Nice. I got it. You got it? Nice right here. Nice red fish. Keep reeling. Are you gonna pull hard? It's a nice fish. Get ready. Keep reeling. Oh, nice one. Nice, nice. Let me get the line. David, watch out. Let me get the line. Okay, I'll bring it up. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Dad! I caught it. Well, he caught it, but I reeled it in. Together, this real Dream Makers team celebrated a big victory for James and for the Bartles family, a day they'll always cherish. I couldn't have picked a better person to spend the day with. Uh, my, all three of my boys and James Shields, you know, it was just, he's so good with the boys. You know, it was just a phenomenal day. So, and I know that these guys have really made their dreams come true to be able to hang out with a professional baseball star. It's been a great day. It's always nice to relax and go fishing. Especially on a day like today, it's a little, little breezy, not too hot. Good to spend some time with the kiddos. Just another great day for Real Dream Makers. You know, Ed and his family do just some, some stuff that not everybody does. I mean, to bring all those kids, 10 kids, into their home and take care of them the way they do, it's a real special thing. And then for me to fish for a living here in Central Florida, uh, which is a blessing to be able to give back, spend a day with James Shields, my good friend, Captain Justin Kaufman, catch some fish for these kids, see them smile. It doesn't get any better than that, and that's what Real Dream Makers is all about. Be a part of the Real Dream Makers and, and uh, you know, getting these kids out there and, and uh, hopefully accomplishing one of their dreams. I'm glad to be a part of it. To go out on a charter boat, it's definitely been a Real Dream Maker for him because it's just, it's just a phenomenal day to hang out with James Shields and, and these great captains that we went out with. It's just been, it's been a great day. <laughs> From the boat to the ballpark, Big Game James gives the Bartles family a real home team advantage. Beef O'Brady's has an all-new lunch menu from 11 to 3. Double dog it. Or bowl over that appetite with a grilled veggie bowl for just $4.99. Or the jumbo combo, including fries and a drink. And your wallet will still thank you. See you at Beef's. Now, at Tradewinds Island Resorts, the coolest, most exhilarating water sports ride of your life. Jetland. It's unlike any thrill ride you'll ever experience. You can fly. Take your beach vacation to new heights at Tradewinds Island Resorts on St. Pete Beach. The only place to fly jet lab on Florida's West Coast. Are you ready to fly? Hi, I'm Cozy, and I played Hazel in the magical movie Dolphin Tale, filmed right here at amazing Clearwater Marine Aquarium. I love coming back to visit Winter and all the animals and to relive Winter's amazing real life story. You can see her in person, up close, this close, just like I did in Dolphin Tale. Seeing Winter is a life changing experience and the people are so helpful. No better place for a family experience. Kids only $14.95. Welcome to Beef O'Brady's. Give me the steak bowl. Steak tacos. Steak burritos. Steak quesadillas, and we will share the steak nachos to start. Let me guess, steak out? It's Beef O'Brady's new Angus steak lineup from $7.99. See, See you, you at Beef's. Beef's. Whoa! Welcome to the Rays game, everybody. 
Real Dream Makers has a field of dreams in store for the Bartles family. Go Rays! Amy and Ed and their 12 children will see their favorite team play. Off to the game. The Tampa Bay Rays. With VIP access to the players and pre-game batting practice. We got everyone glory sitting behind us. BJ Upton. There are plenty of souvenirs. I got a picture with them. I got my side. I got a picture with them. But the real bonus. How's it going, guys? A visit from their favorite player, James Shields. Don't you have enough of my autograph? His big game, James Club, is also dedicated to helping foster children find happiness. You guys do a tremendous job, and, I, and I, I'm really, really, these kids are grateful, and we're all grateful that you guys do what you guys uh, do. So I'm gonna present you guys with the uh, Tampa Bay bat with your guys' uh, family name on it. So you guys can go ahead and put that up in the house. We're just so touched, and we're gonna have a friend and hung up. It's just amazing, I can't believe it. And he's such a down-to-earth guy, and such a nice guy, and our family really loves him. I hope you guys enjoy the suite this year. The big game James Sweet, where the Bartles have a bird's eye view of an exciting game. And enjoys the spotlight during the seventh inning stretch. And to top it all off, the Rays won yesterday, three to two. Go Rays. Up next, even more surprises for the Bartles family. Welcome back! Our community is a better place to grow up thanks to the Rays Baseball Foundation. Through grants, scholarships, and other programs, the Rays put one million dollars back into our area each year so we can feel the effects of Rays Baseball on and off the field. When you have meat as good as we do, you want people to know it. You want them to experience how much better meals can be with a more flavorful foundation. Hey, Nancy, welcome back. Black Angus, you're gonna love that. Yep, when you got meat as good as we do, you're tempted to try something a little crazy. We are Meat Bay! Kevin, it's Sweet Bay! Aw, oh, come on, Jerry! It looks pretty sweet though, right? Maybe you should come up here and yell Meat Bay with me. I think you'd change your mind. If I could get away, I'd spend the day just letting go. Tossing the air, I'll do as I dare. It's my oasis made to just let go. Placing away your crazy play. It's my time. Watch me just let go. Escape to Tradewinds Island Resorts, St. Pete Beach. Reserve your sunset now and save with great fall rates. Just let go. The Bartles Foster family, successful in rescuing and helping to raise troubled children, say they needed this real dream makers adventure to revive them. Well, I think real dream makers, I mean, they've definitely the ones that have made this possible. Mm -hmm. And we totally appreciate it. I know the children do. We never, ever no. could have done this on our own. And I have to tell you, my greatest joy is in watching the children in all of this. It is awesome. We've done so much, and then they see something else, and it's just unbelievable. You know, I have a family of four children, and when I see the difficulty and the challenges that this family goes through to improve these kids' lives, it touches my heart, and I know it touches the hearts of most people out there who are watching this show. We are so excited to be just a small part of it. I would say, you know, if anything can come out of this story, it would show that foster care brings to, you know, our society. Obviously, everybody's goal is to get these children adopted or home. But you know, there's, there's so many children in care and there's not enough homes. I've had a tough life. My parents, they really didn't follow up on what they're supposed to, they, what they were supposed to do. This vacation means a whole lot to me. I mean, when I grow up, I'm gonna bring my children here, try to give, try to reenact on my actions and give my kids the life that I never had.
you guys did all these things for us so you can show other people how dreams can come true. Real dream makers have courage, hope, and faith. I would say real dream makers have brought a close family even closer together. And I would agree with that. And then I would. <laughs> <laughs> One of our boys told us the other day, this is the craziest family I ever lived with. Oh. And I said, yes. Anthony, that wasn't nice. And he said, it's a good crazy mom, I like it. <laughs> <laughs>